Welcome to Area DMG. Welcome back to Area DMG, the last mistake on the internet. We're going to play um, a game that was provided by the company that made it. So uh, let's go ahead and take a look at this. I'm your host, Philip Wesley, the Mile My Mouth, and today we're looking at Ground Shatters. Um, what is this called? Oh. Sky Scrappers! Sky Scrappers! Yeah, Sky Scrappers. Wow, that's not intended to be a uh, shoot fighter at all. There we go. Let's turn that down a little bit. Yeah. Vertical mode, so if you have the uh, flip grip, you can use it on that. Okay, let's check the options. Eh, let's keep that on. Let's do a new game. Yeah, I know, single player. I'll just override it, it's fine. <coughs> oh, man. So, you can do, um... One of four people. Kachiru. Solim. Phileas. Jessica. Yay? Anyways, I think these people have storylines or something, but... Uh, let's get back into it. Let's pick this character here. Just cool looking. Here we are in Dallas, Texas. An old bank building. 100 meters. Basic idea is you're trying to climb this building and attack the other person while you're doing it. And then you just double tap or super tap things. Yeah. Jumping. Oh, hey, Jessica. Oh, hey, Mark. Yes. Hey. Oh my god, this is some compelling dialogue. In it? I mean, seriously. Woo! <laughs> I have goosebumps about this. Yeah, like, right away. Do you want to grab the coffee sometime? Will that be before or after I smash you into a thousand tiny pieces? Uh, so she's one of those. Um, I'm flexible. Oh, he's so woke. Anyways, let's see what we got here. Uh, which buttons do what? Okay, this is my jump button. Jump. Oh, wait. So, we're just jumping up on things and avoiding... Um, whoa. Yeah, so the basic idea is to climb the, uh, the building by running on things. And double jumping. And avoiding trash. Like that guy. <laughs> oh man. <coughs> um, yep. By the way, this is four player, I think? Yeah. But it only seems to have like four characters. Oh, okay then. No. Oh. Wait, he climbed the building before me. Oh. Okay. Well, let's do this. Round two. By the way, you can bounce off little building parts. Yep. Oh, and avoid the flaming building parts. And the higher up you um, go, like, the higher the angle you, you project yourself from, the um, quicker you'll climb. No! Oh, man. Oh, yeah, I knocked him out. Cool. Okay, so now we're in round three. So I guess everyone's this one. Yeah, final round. A lot of uh, fire, stuff being on fire here, you know? I wonder if it's easier just to knock him out. Oh, yeah, there's some type of slam move, brick swing. Wow, we are not climbing this properly. Oh, by the way, you can throw the trash at people. 
GTA. I'm imagining this would be pretty decent with like people. Um, not against the AI. Hmm. That was a pretty long jump, dude. Here, let me uh, let me show you the way. Oh, he he eliminated himself. Okay. So well, uh, yeah. This so far, this is Scry Cat Scry Scrappers. It's almost said like Sky Scrappers. Why? I, I, I don't know if there's any other characters you can unlock, but, um... Okay, so... Oh, I have a special bar. Okay. Wait, something of a prize man? Only for sparking comes in. And let other people into your world. Weird. You know, I... This character has, like, no real good motivations. I mean, somebody needs to kill her parents so that she has some kind of interesting backstory. That's how it works, right? In these types of things? Yeah, right now. Okay. Yeah? So, at least this um, right here isn't as uh, small as that previous one. Whoa! So there's a chance that either one of us will win by getting there first, or the uh, Oh, wait, what? <sighs> okay. Hmm. What do I think of this so far? I think it'd be interesting to see it with, like, other, other people. Yeah, this would be an interesting game to test on people. Yeah, maybe we'll do that with, like, Sweet, Sweet Pass Aurora. In the futures. Oh, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. There we go. Ah. Yeah, the controls are moderately floaty. I mean, as can be expected, since it is a jumping type game. Very jumping, jumping, much jumping, very things. Yep. Round three. I'm just gonna knock her out. Mama said knock you out, girl. Yep. Avoid that stuff. No. Vertical. But I can't be admiring my opponent yet. I need to be killing him. Let's start putting some of the scrapping in the skyscrapers. They're like, uh. Long lost Skylanders? I don't know. To be honest, the character designs make me think of, like, uh. Generic, like, Robotron or, uh. Um. Who's sudden death? Oh, I win. Oh, I have to win three of these, don't I? Okay. Bam. Bum, bum, bum. Watch out for those, I suppose. Okay. Whoa. She hit that thing up at me. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. Oh, this is not good for me. Oh yeah, I'm just gonna knock you. Oh, what? No! Ah, well, this just makes this interesting to watch, right? Sort of? I bet this is, um, this is one of those things where it doesn't look that good to watch. It's probably better to play it. Now, um, it's available on the eShop, like, I think it's available currently right now, and, uh, it seems like one of those games that you probably might see on sale and be like, hmm, and if you see it on sale, you should probably pick it up, 
I don't think it's that expensive either. Um, it was provided by the company behind it, so um, I have to actually do a little bit more research and find out how much it actually costs at the eShop. That said, uh, it's probably not that expensive, and let's be honest, it's it seems to me like one of those um, games that would be like kind of fun to like you know you just have it. You know what I mean? Boom! Yeah. Oh yeah, we're almost up there. I don't know why these are uh, these uh, things are like that. Yes. Well, I beat her. Yep, we're at the 10 minute mark. Let's see if we fight the other person. I wonder what the story mode, I mean, story mode wise, it's kind of like, oh, look at these four characters. Objects that are on fire are harmful, just like real life. You can still bounce off them and smack them about, but just don't let them hit you. Yeah. No, it's funny. My badly drawn face. They let a geriatric into this contest? That my great great grandfather wrote in his journal about secret order of mercenaries that more than a very just as ours up with the dumb That's funny, I don't think I'll ever stop laughing. Wow. Um This dialogue is terrible. That's fine. You clearly have nothing to to anyone. I guess not. Because, like, this is a one-note red-headed Mary Sue. Oh, no. Yes. Ah. Once, once you get the hang of it, um, it can be a little unfair to the AI. Whoa there. Mr. Ground Pound up here. No, 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 no. Okay. Yes, I got him. Huh. This one's gonna be easy. Round two. Fight. Yeah, do your worst, buddy. Let's uh let's see what you're made of inside. That's why I got my sword. Yeah. I like the idea of this. I kind of feel like it should have more characters, though. Definitely. Whoa. I feel like there's some mechanical stuff that they need to fix for it. Physics-wise. But the overall basic idea is solid. Just a little bit, they need to find a way to confine it more to that and, you know, bring it up a little bit. I feel they're, the, um, kind of randomly generated, like, nature of the debris is kind of bad. Yep. Like, maybe if they had set maps or things for people to learn. So it wasn't more or less just like, kind of decide whether you're going to uh, kill them one way or the other. I feel like there should be more two combos, is right? Now one thing I noticed when I, I was uh, playing it earlier actually, that save file, is that once you beat these characters completely, you start fighting them in sets. They're like, up next. Two of the same people you fought before. But now you're fighting them at the same time. Which is kind of what this does. I haven't gone through it yet where I'm fighting all three at the same time. I'm like, okay. <sighs> I think that Jessica is really into me. <laughs> I'm sorry, I need that on a shirt. It's like, I get exceptionally different vibes. Yep. 
The old man is right. Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. That's why you never try to act behind the back of a shadow mercenary. Yes, child. Good call, lesson learned. Mm. Yeah, the um, free fight stuff is actually like so bad it's good. It's honestly one of the, like, okay, sorry, I like the concept a lot. I feel like the physics are a little bit too wonk it. I don't know. Oh, wait, he knocked the other person out for me. Good. Oh, no. There we go. Sudden death. No. Come back, Shinobi. Boom. Yeah, let me uh, bounce you around a bit onto things. Yep, I win. Anywho, that's kind of what this game is. You play the pro play it with a pro controller. That's good. Round two, fight. Actually, let me yeah, quit from here. But yeah, this uh, wait, no, I didn't mean to do that. No. There we go. Sky Scrapper. There's a how to play thing that demonstrates a little bit about how to play it, but yeah, we don't need to. Let's take a look at the credits. How many people worked on this? Mm. Nice. I don't know if this was originally like a, just a PC game or a uh, mobile game. I don't know. Huh. These are the uh, credits, as you can see, by the credit nature of the credits. Yep. I do like that logo, Ground Shatter Game. So what do I think of Skyscrapers? Well, I'm not going to sit down and review it anytime soon, but I did decide to play it and show you what it looks like, just in case, uh, actually let me see what this thing costs on... Uh, the eShop. eShop. Sky Scrappers. Bum, ba, da, bum, bum, bum. Let's see, what does Nintendo say it costs? Do, 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 do. Ch, ch, ch. Oh, it's $9.99. This is a uh, $10 game with um, up to four players. Round one. Yep. Fire. Huh. At ten dollars? Mm, okay. If you reliably have four people to play with, this could be a fun time. Just, you know, losers drink. Um, but I don't know. At ten dollars, I'm not completely sure. Now, if it's on sale, like for half that, um, buy it immediately. Yeah, yeah, like five bucks for this would be amazing. Five bucks for it is a little, hmm, but it just depends on what your um, mileage might be. Like, do you have a lot of people who um, you can play these types of games with? Yeah. It would might be worth it then, but uh, my suggestion maybe wait for a sale. Round two, but that's yeah, that's my take on it. I feel like these people put a lot into it, and they did a good job with it. There's some good concepts, and I wish I had some more characters. Like if this had eight characters and that same goofy-looking um, single player, like the single player mode's dialogue is kind of bad. And that's what I like about it. So, um, yeah. This is Skyscrapers. Hit that thumbs up if you haven't already. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Hit that like button. Hit the comments below. Let me know what you think. And uh, ring that little bell so that you're notified whenever we have a brand new video here on Area DMG. Until the next video comes out, you are now caught up. Morning, Maya.